I just finished filming a home workout for you guys. By 2014, Brittany Dunn Davis had become a social media fitness influencer. Kind of resonated with me just because it's something I've like dealt with in my past. Corey Reale had just started using Instagram and decided to buy Davis's fitness and nutrition plan. I gained between eight to nine pounds that like kind of like first week, um, which is detrimental to somebody who has battled eating disorders. Despite a promise for personal coaching, Davis replied to Reality's concerns with generic affirmations. I started to feel those like red flags pop up and I just had to literally make the decision. It's like, I'm done. Last year, the Texas AG's office sued Davis for deceptive business practices, asking for up to $1 million, claiming she sold plans without personalizing them and even charged shipping fees for digital plans. I'm sorry for anyone that feels hurt or, um, Scammed. The case has now been settled, with Davis agreeing to pay $400,000. Another $130,000 can be added on if she violates the agreement, which bans her from selling personal plans without providing coaching and claiming to have special eating disorder knowledge. I believe I read that like four times just to make sure I was reading what I was reading. Reality says years later, it feels like there's finally accountability. I'm not trying to get my $90 back. It was never about the money for me. Davis, who didn't respond to a request for comment, has to close her business, which she's already pivoted to spiritual content. Fitness and health are no longer my identity. Um, my identity is in Christ. She's now selling Christian retreats for up to $300. Be cautious, honestly, because a scammer is a scammer is a scammer. In Dallas, I'm William Joy.